Hey everybody, welcome back. Today I am making a quick and easy dessert. Now, I saw this on Beautiful Creations 2. I think that's the name of it. I'm going to do a little bit different, but Miss Donna made a strawberry cheesecake dump cake. I'm not a big fan of dump cake, but I do like strawberry cheesecake, so I'm going to give it a try. Now, I have a few ingredients here that I'm going to show you, and we're going to get started. This is something quick. It's simple. It's easy. You can do it for yourself. You can do it for your family, for after dinner. You can take it to a potluck. I mean, it's endless what you can do with it, but I know you're going to enjoy it, so let's go ahead and get started. All right, here we go. Okay, so what I have here is some melted butter which we're gonna mix with the strawberry cake, okay? To make a crumb topping. I have strawberry pie filling here, two cans, all right? Also, this is whipped cream cheese. I have um, 12 ounces of that. I also have here some sugar because this is not sweet enough for me. Um, and some powdered sugar that we're going to add to the cream cheese. Also, I love lemon juice. Um, in any type of berry dessert I'm going to make, it just brightens the flavor. And of course, a little vanilla. All right, let's get started. Okay, I'm just going to move some of these things to the side. What I forgot to tell you guys too, we have butter. Okay, a stick of butter. This stick is already melted. And I'm going to do a few little pats of butter inside the cake, okay? So let's get some of this moved over. All right. So what we want to go ahead and do first is get our cake mix mixed in with the melted butter. And we're going to set that aside, all right? And you can make this with any cake you want. You can do white cake or you can do butter cake, yellow cake, vanilla cake, whatever you desire. Okay, we're just going to get that mixed together. I think that's gonna be good enough. I don't think I'm gonna need any more butter. Let's see. You wanna just make sure you get to the bottom, make sure there's no dry cake mix. Okay, and it's gonna be kind of clumpy. You can kind of break it up to be as small or of course as chunky as you like. Great thing with easy recipes, you can kind of cater it to how you like it. I also have my oven preheating at 350 degrees. All right, so this is good for now. I'm just gonna set this aside, okay? So that's how we're looking. I'll crumble it up a little bit more. Now, to this cream cheese, I'm making a little mess. To this cream cheese, I'm going to add a little bit of powdered sugar. Maybe about a fourth of a cup. And a little bit of vanilla. Um, that was a little bit. <laughs> I guess, uh, maybe that was about a tablespoon. Alright, and we're just gonna mix that on together. Vanilla kind of turned my cream cheese beige, but that's okay. That's quite alright. We're gonna still work with it, right? Okay, so that's about how you want it to look right there. All right. Let's 
Just make sure there's nothing left at the bottom. Okay. Now I'm going to set that aside. Now, I have a pen here, just an aluminum pen. You can use whatever you like, but it needs to be about 9 by 13 inches, all right? I'm going to spray it with a little bit of butter spray. This is probably not necessary, but I'm going to do it anyway. Okay. Then I'm going to add my strawberries. Trying to minimize dishes, you guys. So I'm going to use this spatula that I mixed that with. Okay. Now these pie fillings, they don't be sweet enough. So I'm gonna add some sugar to it. I can't remember how much Miss Donna added, but I'm gonna add it to my taste. So, I don't think I'm going to need a whole cup. Let's do half of it. Alright. I'm also going to add a capful, which is probably about a teaspoon, of the lemon juice. Maybe a tad bit of the vanilla too. Just a capful. Okay. And just mix all that together. I'm not scraping the bottom because I don't want to get all the way to the bottom of this and kind of disturb the butter spray. So I'm just kind of going through over the top in the middle. All right, that should be good. Get that smooth out real good. Smooth. Okay. Now, for the cream cheese, we're going to just do dollops of cream cheese all over, this, all over the top of this, guys. Let's kind of spread it a little bit. Make sure we get a little cream cheese everywhere. Okay. That looks good. Now, I am going to add a little bit of butter in here. Let's go ahead and get this out of the way. Sorry, you guys, it's not even. There you go. Thought you guys could see it. I didn't have it in the frame good. Okay. Okay. Still a little butter in here. And y'all, this is like your cheat day or something because this is not a, <laughs> a low cal dessert now. 
This is not a low calorie dessert. That should be good. Let's see. Get that little side. That little side. And just got a little piece in the middle. That should be good, huh? And that's about um a little bit under half a stick, okay? That was about three and a half or so tablespoons. Now we're gonna go ahead and get our crumb topping on. I have nails and I don't really want it to go under the nails. I'm gonna put a glove on. Okay. And we're just gonna crumb this right on top. All right, in the oven it goes. I think it needs about 45 minutes or so, but I will let you guys know exactly how long it bakes. Here we go, guys. This is it out of the oven. It got a little brown, but that's okay. I'm excited to taste it. Okay, y'all. Now we're just gonna make a little drizzle to go on top. I got some powder sugar here. All right, that's about a cup, okay? I'm gonna add a little bit of butter flavor to this just because I want to. Okay, a little more. And you can use milk or water. You know what, I think I'm just gonna use a little bit of water. Okay. And we're just gonna mix it up. So we're getting it mixed. It's a nice consistency. And we're just gonna drizzle this on over the top. Drizzle, drizzle, drizzle it over. Over the top of this. Strawberry cream cheese dump cake. Okay, oops, I didn't mean it. All right. Okay. This ought to be good. Let's see. I think I like that consistency. That's good. Okay. Let's get a spoon and 
Clayton the fourth not in his death so conservative. I just want y'all to get a good look. Just feast your eyes on all of that goodness. Yes. Now it's time to taste. <laughs> it's time to taste y'all. I'm excited. Oh my God. That thing is good. Mm. It's delicious, y'all. Girl. That's good. Y'all need to make this. For real. Y'all need to make it. It is delicious. Alright, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. Love y'all so much. Until next time. Bye. Have this. You got to try it. It's the best. It is good. Very good. Mmm. Mmm. Compliments to the chef. <laughs>